Hey guys, welcome to my AI content detector and AI text detector video tutorial. So as you can tell by today's video title, I'm going to be showing you how you can basically detect AI content. I'm going to be going through the um, best ChatGPT detector and also a AI content detector. So you can use this tool I'm about to go through in today's video to see if your content is actually AI generated essentially, right? So that's what this video is going to be all about. I'm going to be going through a live demo showing you how it all works so you can really um, see and basically utilize the best AI content detector that's actually currently available on the market at the time of recording this video. So we will provide a link down below to that in the video description. And before I start, I just really want to emphasize that I've actually tested and tried a lot of AI content detectors. Um, a lot of them are pretty subpar and for the most part, they just don't actually work. But this particular one I'm about to show you in today's video, for me personally, at the time of recording this video, has worked extremely well and I've tested it in multiple different like scenarios. So I'm pretty confident um, that it actually does detect um, AI content um, and it's quite accurate. So without further ado, let's begin today's video and run a bit of a test. So there's going to be two different things we're going to be testing during today's video. So the first thing I want to test, um, I'm going to be going ahead and actually creating a blog post. So a bit of text that we're going to be using inside of a chat GPT right here. And the second test we're going to be doing in today's video is testing this content right here to see if the AI content detector is going to detect this as original content because this content right here is content that I actually paid my team to write. So I know for a fact that it's 100% handwritten and not AI generated. So we're going to be doing those two main tests in today's video. So first and foremost, let's do a live demonstration. Let's copy this ChatGPT prompt and let's go over here to... Uh, let's, just, let's just go to the best version of ChatGPT. So... Um, let's go ahead and do this. Write me a blog post on how to make a green smoothie. So it'll go ahead and do that for me right now. As you can see, it'll generate the text. Great. So I'm just going to go ahead and let it do its magic. And the tool we're going to be using, by the way, is a tool called originality.ai. So if we go over here and click on start a new scan, and I'll leave a link down below to this as well. And if there are any better tools in the future that um, might be even better than this, then I'm going to be updating the description down below to the best AI content detector. But um, let's go ahead and just go ahead and go back to ChatGPT. It should be nearly done, hopefully. <laughs> um, so let's go ahead and copy this. And let's paste it right here inside of originality.ai. And let's scan it. So let's see if it detects it as um, AI generated content because it's literally generated by ChatGPT. So um, let's utilize this ChatGPT detector right now. So it will scan. You can also check it for plagiarism as well. So um, it not only covers like, you know, AI, but you can also like make sure it's not like what, you know, um, basically plagiarized, right? So that's also something you can just keep in mind and utilize for your own benefit. Um, so it does take a little bit of time. It doesn't take too long and as you can see it is a hundred percent ai when of course i just demonstrated it live to you that um i generated this text inside of chat gbt so it is hundred percent ai generated content so as you can see it is fairly accurate because it just works so for me personally this this is what i use to determine if content that i receive what i'm like hiring from like writers you know or stuff like that um, if content is like generated by AI or not. And sometimes, you know, I'll notice that like a lot of the times, like when I get like different, like testing out different like writers, like it won't be like 100% AI, but like it might be like 33% original or like 70 or, you know, something like that, or even like 20% original and then like 80% AI. So um, you gotta be careful of that as well when hiring writers because they kind of like, you know, sneaking in a little bit, right? So let's go ahead and test out my content right here that is actually, 100% handwritten because again, I know for a fact that my write-up, this one particular write-up that I hired about a year or two ago is actually legit. So let's go back over here to originality.ai. We'll go to dashboard, start new scan, and we'll put in the content right here. Again, it's 100% original. Let's just see what originality.ai says about it and we'll just let it do its magic. So this basically is an old article. It's to do with like Amazon FBA, which is a business model. So um, just for context, what this piece of content is all about. I just took out like a snippet of it. All right. So yeah, 100% original as you guys can see. 
um, I already knew that, but it's nice that the tool is basically accurate. Now, of course, I want to have a bit of a disclaimer um, that originality.ai, and quite frankly, any AI you know content detector isn't going to be 100% perfect, okay? So there has been times where it's not perfect, by the way, okay? And it does like sometimes make a couple of mistakes. But for the most part, like it is basically a good tool that gives you a rough estimate of whether or not content that you um, are receiving or you know you're detecting is AI or original. So it's a good you know estimate. Again, nothing to 100% accurate. So I really want to emphasize that disclaimer. Yeah, I just wanted to quickly mention that. So if you do want to learn more about this, I'll provide a link down below. I am an affiliate, by the way, which basically means I just get a, a, a small commission if you do end up like using the tool and buying it. Um, that's at no extra cost to you whatsoever. Um, so I do want to like mention that as well. Um, this tool is actually very cheap. So as you can see, I've got like a pretty big balance right here, like a thousand plus credits. And that even isn't like too expensive. Like to give you context right here on their website, like their price and they're saying it costs 0 0.01 cents. So basically like one cents per credit. So, um, and one credit scans a hundred words. So that's what they're saying on their website right here. So it's pretty cheap. You don't have to like, you, you don't like go for any subscription plans or anything like that. And, um, yeah, it's pretty cool. So I'll leave a link down below to this tool um, in the video description. Again, if there are any better tools, by the way, in the future or originality.ai doesn't work anymore for whatever reason, I'll upload the links down below so you can get access to the best AI content detector tool as well. Um, make sure to leave a like on the video if you find value and if you want more videos like this regarding AI and um, comment down below if you have any questions as well. And um, yeah, that's basically it. So thanks for watching today's AI content detector and AI text detector and the uh, chat GBD detector video. So thanks for watching. Cheers.